Are you in need of reducing your yearly operational costs? Is your facility regularly failing to meet stricter EPA discharge requirements or struggling to recover from bioshock due to excessively varying hydraulic flows and regular BOD shock loading? Are you in need of upgrading your facility to meet with ever-increasing hydraulic flows and BOD loads as your production increases? Or do you need to dispose of bloods and fats, for example, the meat slaughtering and dairy industry? PVA gel biocarrier may just be the solution you've been looking for. PVA gel biocarrier is a smooth 4mm in diameter spherical hydrogel bead with the composition of polyvinyl alcohol hydrogel. It has been demonstrated to be ideally suited for the biodegradation of all organic contaminants of all wastewater types and is particularly effective in high BOD loads. PVA gel is highly permeable and has a very high water content due to its good porosity. This in turn creates very favourable conditions for oxygen and nutrients to be drawn in by the nitrification and denitrification bacteria colonised within its structure. It has a specific gravity of around 1.025 which promotes excellent fluidity within the holding tanks by using existing aeration and stirring methods. It has an internal network of minute pores of around 20 microns in size in which only active bacteria are housed. For the nitrification process, aerobic bacteria is colonized on the outer one to two millimeters of the surface of the bead. And for the denitrification process, anaerobic bacteria is colonized in its central structure. No protozoa or dead bacteria are attached to the smooth outer surface of the bead, although a small percentage of new flock and bacteria is also present in the surrounding wastewater. Within a standard activated sludge system, you will find that the protozoa and the metazoa are always the biggest proportion, and the bacteria is a very small proportion. The protozoa, metazoa and bacteria are in the following proportions. With the PVA gel, you will see that the bacteria is the biggest proportion and the protozoa and the metazoa are much smaller in proportion, which means that you're going to get a much more effective treatment process because you've got more healthy bacteria to biodegrade the contaminants in the wastewater. Within the internal structure of the PVA gel bead, the structure looks like this. It is equally well suited for the nitrification and denitrification processes. However, it is also capable of accomplishing both nitrification and denitrification within the same tank due to both the aerobic and anaerobic bacteria being present in the beads at the same time. While other biocarriers boast a surface area of between 450 to 1200 square meters per cubic meter, PVA gel surface area has been estimated by the makers in Japan, as well as independent universities, at between 3000 and 6000 square meters per cubic meter. Due to its extremely impressive surface area, PVA gel requires no more than a 10% mix of the hydrogel in the nitrification and denitrification processes, where other biocarriers require up to a 75% mix. PVA gel is durable and will outlast any other biocarrier as it has been demonstrated in many facilities around Japan for more than 10 years now, where the treatment facilities still don't require replacement or top-up of the gel and have not lost their treatment capacities. A biocarrier which has proven to be very durable and long-lasting for a sustainable and affordable wastewater treatment solution. A biocarrier which can treat much higher hydraulic flows and BOD loads in the same treatment volume with the addition of only a 10% mix of PVA gel. This cost will only account for a fraction of the cost of extending or doubling up your current wastewater treatment facility. A process which recovers much quicker from BOD and hydraulic shock loading, which will allow for the treatment of very high BOD loads, such as that of the meat slaughtering and the dairy wastewaters. 
including the addition of bloods, fats and oils. A solution which makes upgrading your facility affordable and sustainable with only minor changes that would need to be made to the infrastructure to increase the hydraulic flow and BOD load. A technology that will allow for significantly smaller footprint wastewater treatment plant designs and therefore reducing the overall build and operational costs of a new wastewater treatment plant. A significant reduction in yearly operational and maintenance costs as the use of PVA gel has been known to produce up to 40% less excess sludge in municipal and other wastewaters. This could be a significant factor in reducing annual sludge handling and dumping costs. We look forward to you inquiring and assisting you in implementing this exciting technology into your wastewater treatment facility. Call or email us today to find out more about PVA gel and what it could do for your wastewater treatment facility. Also, please make sure to follow us on Facebook and Twitter for the latest news feeds and product developments.